This is based off of one in part of the story Beauty and the Beast, and uh, the other part, it's based off a true event that happened to me that I thought I'd turn into a dramatic reading uh, that I wrote down. I'm not a very good writer, so please bear with me. I just call it The Mirror because it literally takes place during a conversation with a reflection of myself. Oh, what are you smiling about, Mars? Well, I just had a a wonderful day. Uh, I just, uh, I can't believe that I, I, I got to meet some new fans, you know, my YouTube page is taking off, everything's going good. And I've been complimented many times by many people on my voice and my tone, so why wouldn't I be, you know, happy? (laughs) Just when I thought you couldn't get any more pathetic, look at you. You're smiling over what? People who pretend to be your friends, who say they're going to help you out. What have you really done, though? Take a look around you, man. Look. You're still stuck in these four rooms. You still have no way out. You're stuck completely. And you're stuck with me, myself, and I. You loser. Whoa, whoa. Dude, I think you need to calm down a little bit. You're kind of bringing me down now. It's only 10 a.m., (laughs) look at you you're just smiling away thinking the world gives two shits about you let me ask you something marzy when was the last time you actually got a real comment well I don't know, I guess a couple days ago. Was it a real comment, though? Was it anything awesome? Was it anything good? Uh, I guess not. (laughs) You see? You're going nowhere in life. You're just deluding yourself. You're nuts. You're a god damn vampire look at you you fucking freak look how fat you are hey what wow why are you insulting yourself like this i mean we got the same damn body you piece of shit (laughs) you're the one who's the piece of shit my friend you're so stupid too you can't even see the lies that are being put in front of you You think the bronies care? You think anyone really cares about you? If you do, then you're an idiot. Why would they care about an ugly, fat, talentless hack who has nothing better to do than go on YouTube and desperately search for friends? I... I... uh, I... Oh, I, 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 you see, you see what a loser you sound like, you ugly, vile piece of garbage. Now, come on, come on, that's not true. I mean, I'm, I'm handsome. I'm, I, I have a nice, I have nice hair. I mean, I. <laughs> Your hair, oh, your beautiful, precious hair. I forgot all about that. Please stop right now. No, I'm I'm just getting started. Look at you. You got those fucking buck teeth. (laughs) And look at that mustache. God, man, you look like the 90s had a miscarriage. Well... I guess you're right. (laughs) Are you crying? (laughs) You're crying, aren't you? (laughs) Oh, God. (laughs) 
when I thought you couldn't get any more pathetic. Oh, here you are crying like a little bitch. You cannot go into sunlight. What makes you think anyone gives two craps about you? You are nothing more than a subhuman mutant. You're right. That's all I am. I am just a subhuman mutant. I don't have any worth or value. Exactly. <laughs> you have no worth, no value, nothing. You are are worthless. I have seen dog turds with more purpose in life than you. Stop it. No, I'm gonna keep going until you learn what it is to be in this place. Do you know what we're going to have to face? Loneliness. Poverty. Unacceptance. Hatred. All those good things are gonna be us. Yours. Mine. Everything. <laughs> Stop it. Stop it. No. Stop it. No. Shut up! I'm not a monster. I'm not a monster. Thank you very much, and I hope you enjoyed that.